Now, Bjorn Borg obviously is a, he was a complex man and there was a lot of internalisation of his emotion. So for you as an actor to explore that must have been a, an exciting opportunity. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Both the psychology and the, the physical part, the tennis. And um, obviously there's a physical side to the part as well. And, and Borg was known for his... Um, extremely powerful serves so how did that then how did you have to prepare for that role to be able to encapsulate that role? just play a lot of tennis play tennis two hours a day with the coach uh, eat right uh, work out uh, it, it's it, it was mostly about that in the beginning for half a year just getting in shape and learning the, the game so there was such a transformation when you when you where you got the hair and the costumes. What was it like when you first sort of saw yourself in the mirror and thought, oh my God, I am beyond Borg? Well, it, it, came, it, it came in small doses. It was actually my own hair. Uh, so, and I, I just saw my body transform and I saw the hair grow, so, so little by little. Yeah. Did you work at all with Beyond? To, 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 did you um, speak to him at all to, to help better get understand him as a person and not just refer to the script? No, no, I did not. Uh, I, I just watched everything I could find about him. Uh, but his son is playing the young Borg. Uh, but I decided to meet him afterwards. Uh, that would help me. So.